Hi everyone, Happy New Year. It's the 1st of January 2020 when I'm doing this and I hope you all have a really beautiful year this year. I was talking to a friend yesterday um, about having a clean-up. I'd been going madly tidying, putting things away for the first time I can see the top of my desk and the kitchen work surfaces. It feels really great this morning coming up to that. Um, and on my windowsill I had all the autumn leaves and conkers and things there and I cleared them and put them in the compost bin. I was talking about that and she saw the picture that's behind me now. And we started talking about past experiences and wouldn't it be great if actually all the things we'd ever lived right up till this moment, we could put in the universal compost bin and allow them to mulch down and become really great food to grow new things. And I thought it's a perfect time to think about that now. Wouldn't it be great if right now you could decide everything that's ever happened has happened? And all the things that came from it, came from it. That was then and this is now. I've survived, it's okay. I'm going to use that to grow the rest of my life in the way I want it. So I thought we'd perhaps do a bit of tapping on that if that's okay. So tapping together, mostly on the karate point, as those of you who've done it with me before know. So even though I've experienced so many things in my life. Some good, some not so good, some indifferent. And I've made meanings, beliefs, vows and decisions based on all of them. I love and accept myself and all the me's that I was then. Even though I may also be carrying stuff from my ancestors that's come down the family line, I may have brought things in from other lives I've lived. I love and accept myself anyway. Even though I've got all of this experience and I've been using it to help me live my life with the things I decided then, I'm open to the possibility that those things happened, that they're over, I survived. I'm okay. And I don't need to carry them with me for the rest of my life. And I love and accept all parts of me, including the parts of me that thought I did need to carry them with me. And I'd like every part of me to know that what I want to happen now is all those events, all those experiences, all those feelings, vows, decisions and beliefs to go into the universal composter, to be recycled into something much more useful so that I can use that to grow myself the life that I really want to live. So that I can remember who I really am. And from this moment, whether it's the beginning of 2020 or any other time, I can start my life using the juice from the previous experiences to forward me into the life that I really want so that I grow and glow and become more me than I've ever been before and I love and accept myself and all those who helped me on that journey in their own unique way releasing them now from any old outdated contracts, cutting cords to events, feelings, beliefs, 
anything that's no longer for my highest good. So I can start the day and the year and my life from this moment. With the richness and wisdom I've gained without the stuff that's no longer needed. And I love and accept us all, especially me. I've done a great job and that's the truth. And I love and accept myself and anyone else involved, starting afresh, right here, right now. Using all that great compost to create my life as I want it to be. To allow me to be who I want to be. My natural loving self. And so it is. So happy new year to you, whether it's new year or not. It's the beginning of the rest of your life. Have a wonderful time. Bye.